national unemployment rate continues to fall. The U.S. Department of Labor announced last week it dropped to the lowest rate since the start of the COVID-19 pandemic. But as News reporter Tim Harfman tells us, some parts of our area are still facing hardships. The unemployment rate may be low, but there are plenty of people still searching for higher paying jobs. There's people that maybe have come back to work, but they're underemployed and they could be earning more wages and, and have a higher skilled job. Virginia Career Works announced Monday they're reopening their Lynchburg Work Center to its pre pandemic hours in order to help more people find jobs. Appointments are preferred, but walk ins are welcome. They're getting back to work, but but on the other hand, there's more more job openings. Anyone who needs a job should be able to find one right now. Virginia Career Works is also helping employers fill positions like Bedford Regional Water Authority. Okay. Megan Pittman says in recent months they've seen staffing turnover due to competition. We've had people that have jumped ship um, that are more at our entry level because of 50 cents somewhere else. They're forced to remain competitive, offering higher salaries, benefits to entry level positions and other compensation while promoting one of their greatest assets, job security. We provide an essential service to our community and that's never going to stop whether it's a pandemic or any other type of condition. Virginia Career Works is offering services virtually too. Career navigators can walk people through the process either in person or online. There's 2,500 or more job openings right now. To learn more about those openings or other services from Virginia Career Works, head to WSLS.com. In Lynchburg, Tim Harfman, 10 News, working for you.